So this was a video that I, I wasn't planning on doing, um, but I thought I would do it anyway, considering the circumstances. Um, a very entertaining day on Twitter, if you have been following the Wings of Redemption and the El Presidor. Um, for those who don't know, they're both Call of Duty commentators. El Presidor has to be the greatest troll in the gaming community on YouTube. It's, I don't know if he's serious now, even. I don't know. You can't tell with that man, but he's a, he's a genius. I'll give him that. Wings of Redemption, I've never liked. I never will. Um, so I thought I would give you my uh, thoughts on the thing, on the on the big controversy that's happening now. Um, for those who don't know, essentially Wings of Redemption went on another big rant on Twitter about how his life sucks and how everyone else sucks and how white boy sucks and how bitter and jealousy is of everyone else. Um, and then went on to say that he was going to commit suicide. El Presidor thought he would jump in and then Wings of Redemption said that he was going to kill El Presidor. Um, now, serious or not, it's a pretty fucking retarded thing to say on, online. Um, but I think I'll, I'll give you my analysis on, on, the, on the thing here. Not only is this the internet, which fighting over the internet is retarded to begin with, but fighting over YouTube and gameplay commentaries on Twitter is fucking... It's so retarded. Oh, my God. Okay, now here's the thing. I think that when shit like this happens, you really get to see the people that they really are. I mean, they can come across as these nice people online, but then I reckon you get someone pissed off, then you legitimately see what they're really like. Like, if you get me pissed off, you'll probably say, well, you know what I'm like. I'm a sarcastic prick. But these people like to portray it, but everyone hates me. No one likes me. I do lots of stuff on the YouTube community. And then they do all of that, and such as Wings of Redemption's case, and then like to go on Twitter and rampage at White Boy and Hutch um, and Fear, the guy who is like the respawn manager or something, I don't know his name, um, went into a complete bitter, jealous rampage at them on Twitter. And I think that that gives you a, a good idea of who these people really are. Fuck off! Goddamn Skype. Um, Steam, actually, not Skype. Um, God, if it's not that, it's my phone. Fuck me. Anyway, you know what I mean. It, it really tells you who these people really are. And then to come after, like Wings of Redemption said at the end, oh, you all believe that, psych. Mm. After like two hours of bitter, jealous tweets, that's just what happened. Mm. That's a cop-out. Um, but besides that, it's quite amusing for those of us who get to sit back and watch grown men argue about Call of Duty and argue about how they go about making money of Call of Duty on the internet. But like I said, I think this gives you guys a perfect example of what they're really like and what they, and, and then compare, compare that to how they um, present themselves on the interwebs for you guys to like them. So I thought that I would give you my opinion because I got a few messages on YouTube and Twitter. What are your thoughts? So that, that's my thoughts. I think that these things give you an excellent idea of what these people are really like. It was entertainment at its finest. It's extremely sad, but hey, it was amusing. So if you missed it today, sucks for you, but that's what happened. Um, so yeah, I like it. if you were paying attention, I'd like to get your thoughts, but I don't really care. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen, rate, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you think. Au revoir.